Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I actually spoke to y'all. So anyways, I'm back. How have y'all been? I would love to know. So do comment. So today's video I'm going to discuss about the most buzzed about and sought after superstar skincare ingredient that is niacinamide and I'm sure you own a bottle of it. It is sitting on your vanity and the percentage you're currently using could also be a slight giveaway as to how long you've been using this. This one is from the brand Minimalist. Earlier it came in a frosted transparent glass bottle with a white cap dropper. So I started off using niacinamide with a 5% one and uh, the 1% hyaluronic acid in it. This is the variant I started off when I uh, tried the one from Minimalist that is. And uh, the texture of this one is slightly thick. I think it's because of the hyaluronic acid in it. Of course this is a hydrating formula and the dropper here you can see it has a rounded tip but they've changed everything. Now the packaging has changed. The dropper has become more sleek. This did come with an outer packaging which I currently don't have with me. That's because I purchased this way back last year and I've actually completely finished up this product. I just left a little bit to share it with you all for review purposes. Coming to the formula. Now just a few drops of this one will just go on so well on your skin. It gets absorbed real quick. It does not feel sticky and I do top it up with my regular moisturizer. The link of it I will leave in the description box down below. I do apply this after my toner. Now of course toner is a personal choice. I enjoy using a toner. Now uh, this one I would say um, I really like the formula of this one. I have used niacinamide serums from other brands but this one really worked well. So if you are a beginner or just starting off uh, trying out niacinamide in your skincare regime that's really good and I would suggest you can and try this one out. So I really liked what the niacinamide 5% did to my skin so I went and purchased the 10% one with zinc in it. Like I had already mentioned earlier they did change the packaging to a dark amber glass bottle with a black cap and also the dropper became more thinner this time. All information regarding the product like the price, the quantity, the ingredient list, the manufacturing and expiry dates, everything is available on the out packaging and also on the bottle. Both the serums retail at 5.99 for 30 ml and they are fragrance, silicone, oil and paraben free. They have a pH between 5.5 and 6.5 and most importantly they are non-comedogenic. They also help to reduce pigmentation. Let's talk about what the niacinamide 10% with zinc actually did to my skin. So first of all my skin looked healthier. I do have mature combination skin type this made my skin look really well moisturized. It did even out my skin tone. Now I do tan. Everybody in Jenna is prone to tanning. And uh, I do not get crazy acne like before. I guess that's because of my age. I do get occasional acne. And this takes care of fading the tan as well as post acne marks. And also this made my skin look really plump and so healthy. Now I do not use this every day. I prefer using this twice or thrice a week because I like to use my other actives on other days. Now although this is recommended that it does not react with other actives, I'm kind of on the safer side. I like to just use it with my regular moisturizer and my toner. Will I repurchase this? Of course yes. I really like the way this serum transformed my skin to make it look more healthier plump and glowy. I highly recommend this and I really did enjoy using this one. Of course it goes without saying what worked for me will not always work for you because everybody's skin type and concerns are so very different. I really hope you enjoyed watching this review video and if you did don't forget to hit the like button and also comment what you thought about this review. Also turn on the notification bell and subscribe to my channel so that you get notified every time I upload my video. So until my next one, bye bye.